Hello and welcome to Beyond the Lens. First off, I want to give a big shout out and a really, really big thank you to Mark Somerville for creating me a new intro. You've just seen it, it's pretty cool. I'll put a link in the description. Go check out his channel. So today, we're going to have a look at how to do slow motion in Adobe Premiere Pro. Now, this will work in CS5, CS5.5, and CS6. Now, a lot of times, what people will do, they will take their clip into the trimmer, they'll do their in, their out point, and they'll take it in. There, there's our clip. But what they'll do, if they want to speed it up or slow it down, they'll right click, they'll go to speed and duration, and they'll take it down to, say, 50%. If you notice, it's jumpy. That's even. Once it's rendered, it is jumping. You see interla interlaced lines in it. So we don't want that. And we don't. also, you'll notice it does lose quality. So what we're going to do in our project manager, on my clip, I'm first of all going to right click and I'm going to duplicate it. The reason is I don't want to change the um, frame rate on the original footage. Now we've got that, I'm going to right click, I'm going to go to modify, I'm going to go to interpret footage. At the moment, the frame rate is set at 25 frames a second. So we're going to tell it to assume that the frame rate is 8 frames a second. OK, that. Now, if I bring that in my trimmer, you can see it's slower. No interlaced lines. And it's a lot better quality. I'll just get that bit there because it does shorten the length of your clip, but it slows it down. So we'll bring that into the timeline. Move it over a bit, and there we go. We have our two our footage there. Nice. We kept the quality. No interlaced lines. Perfect. And you haven't even. It's not even jerky. So let's have a quick look at the two footages. Um, we'll first do the original and then we'll do the slowed down. I hope this was useful. If it was, click the like button and subscribe because I will be bringing another tutorial next Thursday. In fact, I'll bring them out every Thursday. And I won't just be doing Adobe Premiere Pro, but I'll be covering other aspects of filmmaking. So subscribe and have a great weekend.